How are you at NBA 2K? The best. The best. Anyone who's anyone out there who's willing to take me on, you can come to my court and you can see me in 2K and I'll probably beat you. Hey guys, I'm Rachel and I'm here with Prez, one of the NBA's newest stars. And today we are actually in his personalized my court in your home. That's which right. Looks amazing. Thank you. Welcome to my uh, my humble my court. Um, Basically, yeah, you know, I wanted to build something that reflected who I am as a person, something that I enjoyed, and uh, I eat, sleep, breathe basketball. So when I first made it into the league, I, uh, I put this little thing together. I like it. So I'm sure you spend tons of hours in here practicing many different things, but I know our viewers at home would love to see, I don't know, one of your favorite moves that you like to work on? Move. Okay, yeah, okay. Um, cool. Yeah. Fall right there. <laughs> Let's see. Favorite move. Okay, so say it's a fast break, maybe. Coming down the lane, right hand. Oh. Something like that. All right. I guess I'll give it a try. Let's so see. You, so you're coming down with your right hand. Yeah. Between the legs. Yeah. Spin. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Not so graceful. Rachel for the win. For my first time. That but, was pretty uh, good, though. Have to come back, practice it a little more. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> so going from college to the NBA, it seemed like you made a very smooth transition. It may have seemed like that, but no, it was a it was a challenge, and you know I'm up for the challenge. But uh, you know I had a lot of help from the coaching staff, my trainer Xavier Cross. Xavier, shout out, love you, man, love you, Xavier. He um, he helped me with my diet, my workout routine, stuff like that, and then my teammates. They helped me adjust to the pace of the league and everything. And speaking of teammates, you and Justice Young mm -hmm. have made some crazy noise yes. this season. Yep. Tell me about him a little bit. I mean, what can I say that hasn't been said? He's the man. You know, he works harder than anybody else I know, and uh, it motivates me to work harder. And it's, it's just been nice to see our work translate into success on the court. And your nickname now? Yeah. Did you Orange guys come juice. <laughs> Orange juice? Yeah. Did you guys come up with that? We, yeah, we did. I think we were playing video games one day and we were talking about putting the squeeze defensively on a team and squeeze somehow became orange juice and it turned into a, a thing and people liked it and so we ran with it. And now it's taking off and now there's yeah. even a handshake to it. There's a handshake. Right? You want to show me it? Okay, sure. Ball for a second. Yeah. So it goes backside, snap, 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 snap. and then squeeze. Squeeze. Yeah. And then when you squeeze, you got to say orange juice. Orange juice? Yeah. Okay. Orange, Orange juice. juice. Nice. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> so you said you play video games a little yes, bit. Yes, yes. How are you at NBA 2K? The best. The best. Anyone, who's, anyone out there who's willing to take me on, you can come to my court and you can see me in 2K and I'll probably beat you. <laughs> so what about the competition within your team? Yeah, it's intense. I mean, me and Justice, we play, we play all the time. Usually when we're on the road, Denver will like bring a system so we can play wherever we're at. And uh, it's fun. I love playing it. It's a, it's a great game. Are you the best I, in 2K? The best. The best. The best of the best. Like an all-star, basically. All like right. the president of 2K, <laughs> you know? I've heard that name before. Yeah. <laughs> well, you guys heard it here first. Thank you again for coming on 2K TV. Anytime. And showing off your amazing mm -hmm. my court. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks for coming through. Of course. Good luck the rest of the year. And All I right. don't know, maybe one day we'll see you on a cover of 2K. I would like that. The powers that be. Did you hear that? She said it. I didn't. <laughs> she said it. Cool. Appreciate it. Orange juice. Orange juice. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I hope you didn't think that I was just gonna leave you guys with the 2K TV interview, man. Nah, man. I don't do y'all like that, man. I got this my part gameplay for y'all, man. Now check this out. I'm running with randoms right now. I know you guys like, yo, why is you running with these dudes that's so low level? Listen, listen. I'm running with randoms right now. Uh, but I'm going up against a powerhouse team, though, dog. I'm going up against an all-star four, all-star two. One dude got three badges. Two of them got two. One of them got one bad. Sharpshooters and shot creators. It's about to get ugly out here in these streets, man. But to start the game off, I noticed that these dudes did squad up, so they already have an advantage over our team. Now, I'm not running point guard. You guys will be surprised, but I'm actually the power forward of this match. Now, I know that my guy is hella tall, and I'm hella at a disadvantage, but 
I'm gonna come out here and you know what I'm saying do what I do now. Right there, the ball kind of tipped off my ass. I see now if this was me, you know, playing live, I would have told y'all I'm the best defender ever. But nah, man, that's just right place, right time. Now, one of these dudes named Gratz Montana go ahead and gets the ball. Now, I'm going to let y'all know this early, man. These two are like the dynamic duo, man. They come in and they try to just house everybody because they're bigger, they're taller, they're stronger. But their play style doesn't fit that build. You know, they may be taller and stronger, but they're shooters. They're, they're guys that supposed to move on a shot or take deep threes. I don't know why these guys are trying to go inside, but our guys... Yo, yo. That, 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 uh, what they call him, Pro One that y'all was talking all that crap about early in the video? Yeah, that's right. He yammed all over him, cuz. Yammed all over him. Now, we out here getting these cookies as usual. You know what I'm saying? But the fast break started a little bit too early. I take the three, and of course, unless I get a green light, my shot is not falling. I'm gonna just keep it brutally honest with you guys. I'm a playmaker. When I shoot from deep, unless it's green or I'm in a corner, I'm not making it. That's that's just how the game goes with me, man. But we still out here playing crazy defense. See what I'm saying? And we're using teamwork. Believe it or not, none of us are actually on mics, man. All of us are just playing by intuition. You know what I'm saying? And the ball IQ that we have. Now, right there, the dude takes a step back three, nails it, and I kind of remember that he's a sharpshooter at that point in the video in game i was like yeah, yo my man can shoot from anywhere so you know what i'm gonna go ahead and use him for what he does best now like i told you guys defense is one of my strong suits man even though i'm not a lockdown defender and i try to stick with my guy as much as i can man now that right there i would have asked for the pass like any normal child but i will go ahead and just get past my man ask him to be like excuse me real quick you know what I'm saying? Because one thing that you guys will understand is if I'm at a disadvantage at height, I have the advantage in speed. I'm a playmaker. We ain't dead. I'm going to keep reminding y'all, man. Playmakers ain't dead out here now. You know what you're going to give me. You know you're going to give me them cookies, though. You know what I'm saying? You ain't just going to be all up in my paint thinking you about to do something. Let me go ahead and take them from you real quick, big fella. <laughs> now, it's currently 3 to 9, and I know what you guys are thinking. Yo, these dudes is ass. You know what I'm saying? These dudes got to be terrible because I don't know why, but we just keep getting steals. We keep getting stops. And oh, was that a no look 360? That's right, man. Your boy got his bars up. You know what I'm saying? Attribute bars on fleek on dunking and layup. So it's time, baby. Now, at this point in the game, any team would say, dog, we down 3 to 11. It's about to be a body. We can't hit no shots. What can we do to change the tide? I'm going to just let y'all know now. They can't do shit. It's Rap City, man. I don't care what y'all say. But, nah, man. We still got the pro level one dudes out here trying the best that they can, man. And, you know, I'm not going to be the one to say, hey, man, you can't shoot. Now, luckily there, my guy actually got a bucket because there I go helping out on defense like I said I would. It, it's just it's instilled in me to help out on defense, man. I'm so used to playing my career, so used to my teammates not doing nothing. And that I got to do everything on my own. Now, you guys know how I get down with the dribbling, dog. Right around my defender. And, man, he saved his life. I was about to expose this dude. Put him on one of the craziest no-look. Man, look, I was going in his life. You know what I'm saying? In his life. Now, I told you guys that I needed to get the sharpshooter ready. And bang, bang, bang. Activated. You know what I'm saying? My man got his sharpshooting badge, grand badge activated. It's about time for him to turn up. Now, my guy does shoot threes, but for some reason, I'm just not giving him enough space. But this guy, man, this pro level one dude, lacked on defense. Let this man get open. And just like that, it's a five point game. Anything can happen at this point, man. But look at me using my goddamn dribble sense to get the man in the corner open. Come set the screen. He does a step back in. Oh, no, it rimmed no. down. <laughs> One of those times you just gonna have to blame 2K on that man. And look at me going for the steal. And man, I promise you, man, going for steals in situations like that suck. Because I went for the steal thinking that I was gonna get the ball. I ended up running a little bit too far. My guy got that three-point shot that I didn't want him to get. Now I'm still putting my dribble moves on right around the defender, and I kick out because I thought it was gonna go to the sharpshooter. 2K, man, they hate me, man. They don't, they don't want me to get pretty, man. That's what it is, man. 2K never wants me to get pretty. But I'm trying to do what I do by setting screens for guys because I notice in a lot of people that I play, and these are people that are very technical, very good at the game, 
They love to run screens because the screens are OP this year. You don't get called for moving screens. You can just screen all day. You can even just stand next to a player while one of your uh, teammates is doing a crossover. And you can easily just bump them off the track. But this dude was sitting up here dribbling his heart out. For whatever the case may be, he didn't look at the shot clock. Now we asked out. It's 11 to 3. And they back just like that. They back just like that. And oh, yeah, that's right. This dude is giving up. Man, you know what? Remember I told you about that pro level ball? Yeah, he's he's getting exposed right now. But, I mean, he does have a little bit to say about it. You know what I'm saying? He wants to run the offense. He said, hey, man, I'm the shooting guard. Let me do what I do. Now, kick it out to the sharpshooter. I'm still trying to let him get his grand badge off. And he does another step back and bang, bang, bang. He hits the clutch three that we needed, bro. We're up three points. They're coming down the court. It's 13 to 16, man. And look at this, man. Defensive prowess. Look at the hoffle. Look at the hoffle. You know what I'm saying? This is what this team is all about right here, man. A team full of randoms. A team full of people that trust each other with the ball, man. And look at this pro level one going in with some girth. Okay. I see you, baby. Look, I know this dude was probably pissed that his man was hitting easy shots on him, man. He was getting loose. That's how it is, man. When you one of these lower level players, man, and you getting exposed out here, you just got to come back and just do something yourself. But look at my guy being the point forward that he should have always been. You know said, dude out here think he just grabbed these assists like that. Well, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and run point for a little bit, man. I'm going to go ahead and put this in my hands down. Dude set a screen for me. I noticed this player went to the paint, kicked it out to him, but he didn't take the shot. Don't know why he didn't take the shot. So I tried to set a few screens, but of course that didn't work. But he does see the dude cut into the basket. That's good line of sight right there, man. It just seemed like we all point guards at this point. You know what I'm saying? But it's 15-20. What can they possibly do to come back? Oh, yeah. Let me expose this pro level one right here. <laughs> like, come on, dog. It's crazy how he did that, dog. And look at the shot bounce in, man. I tried to save, dude. I told you guys, man, helping out on defense was going to come back to bite me in my ass. And that's just how it goes, man. I, I just have to stop helping out on defense sometimes. I'm not a big man, but it is what it is. Now I get the ball in the corner. It's time to expose somebody. Let me go ahead and get past you. Oh my God, send them out of bounds. Hold up. Let me step back. Excuse me. Oh, 360. Let's get it. And that's all she wrote, ladies and gentlemen. You already know I got to go with that B-ball. Yeet. You know what I'm saying? Hold up. Hey, guys. Guys, come back, guys. Hey, yo, let me guys, back. come back. I just want to yeet real quick on y'all one time. Where, why everybody leaving, man? What's up? Nobody, nobody want to play no more? Okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you drop a thumb on this journey. Also, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. This is your boy IKC signing out. I'm going to see y'all in the next video. I'll see y'all in the comments as well. Peace.